So in your opinion, why are things priced so high at this point in time? Um, interest rates are low, right? When interest rates are low, that means capital is, is cheap. So people can get cheap loans, right? I think uh, stock market has done really well. So a lot of people have additional money that they can invest in stuff, right? Um, I think, uh, you know, people are looking to maybe diversify and put some of that money that they've uh, uh, gotten gotten from the stock market, put it back into real estate. So that's compressing prices. I also think there's a lot of foreign money, right? Uh, we talk, we've got a good friend who's a multifamily broker in Dallas, Fort Worth. And I remember him telling, telling me that the majority of his buyers are uh, foreign buyers, right? And they're, they're really just trying to place money in the United States in dollars, and they're not that concerned uh, about cap rates. So it's a lot of macroeconomic stuff. But the bottom line is when the economy is doing, doing really well and, and money is cheap, uh, cap rates are going to compress. And, and they've done that, right? But the, the problem is, is they've been compressing for 10 years. So nine years ago, 10 years ago, people were saying the same thing. Like, I'm, I'm just going to sit it out until, until the market, uh, you know, resets. But those people never did any deals. So you got to figure out how to be able to do deals in any market, in my opinion. Thanks for listening to the Virtual Real Estate Investing Podcast, presented by Grayline Investments, where we talk about how to find, fund, and finish deals from anywhere in the world.